Millions of Floridians have a mental or physical disability, which can make communicating with law enforcement in an emergency difficult. But through a new initiative, the Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office is trying to better equip deputies to handle these often challenging encounters. ABC Action News reporter Anthony Hill tells us how this program will work. The Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office has launched a new program that will help deputies better communicate with vulnerable populations. In an emergency response, every second counts. This information will prove invaluable. Project Safe Encounter will allow deputies to have critical information about people who have a physical or mental disability in the event of an emergency. This program is designed for anyone who may be blind, suffering from deafness, Alzheimer's, whatever that special need may be. This is a voluntary program that allows you to register yourself or a loved one. To sign up, you have to fill out a registration form on the Hillsborough County Sheriff's Office's website. They'll ask you for detailed information about the person, along with a photo before reviewing the application. This program is so tremendous because it allows our Sheriff's Office to provide a customized response to anyone who has special needs. You can sign up by going to teamhcso.com. I'll also post a link on our website, abcactionnews.com. Coming up on ABC Action News this evening, I'll bring you the stories of two Bay Area mothers who are desperately looking for their adult children who suffer with mental illness. Plus, I'll tell you about a new state alert system that will make finding adults who struggle with mental illness easier to find. In Tampa, I'm in-depth reporter Anthony Hill, ABC Action News.